there's something about the day. Something else. Something about the day. Something about the day. Something about the day. It's the sweetest day.
God, you can handle it. Amen. Praise God. Somebody say, reach up and grab it. You can handle it. The Holy Ghost. Give the Lord a hand praise for this collection. Glory to God. Amen, amen. Praise God. Amen. We have glory to God. Hallelujah. Praise God. First Pentecost. Amen. We ask them to come up with a collection. Praise God. Give the Lord a big hand praise. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. It's all right to praise.
for yourself. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Give the Lord a big hand praise. Amen. The Lord. This is our youth night. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. We want to ask the young people, amen, glory to God, if they have a selection for us tonight. Amen. We got, amen. Praise God. Amen. Y'all have a selection? Some of the young people. You tonight. Praise God. Amen. It's all in the Praise the Lord. Glory to God. I'm going to sing a song that's on my mind to sing. Y'all pray with me. Come Hallelujah. Amen. Praise Him. 
Will y'all get the song together, the song flow? Okay, y'all come on, cheer. Come right on. Amen. Thank your hands for Amen. Come on. Amen. The sunshine band here. Come on, cheer. Who goes? You know what? I don't even want to 
thank you about it. Amen. I just praise God. I can sing the song and look where he brought me from. Look what he brought me through. Hallelujah. Praise his God. If it had not been for the Lord on my side, Amen. 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 Amen.
and Mother Thompson's friends. Amen. She brought me in the conversation all this week with Mother Thompson. And Mother Thompson, she said, had to go on home today. Amen. Glory to God. But she said, I'll see y'all tonight. Amen. Glory to God. That's a blessing. Amen. She thought she was going to have to go to the school and be at the meeting and they, amen, postponed it for right now. Keep school at the prison, praise God. Amen. And help them get their GED. Amen. We want to have some words from her tonight, right there. Amen. Praise God.
I'm land rich. Right. You ain't got to tell them right away. Just kind of string them along. Let them put their pay tie. Let them give you a little money. You know, string them along. But when they ask you point blank, you know what you're answering. Jesus and them all around. Get them play around each other. And the first he asked them, why don't stop me good? Uh-huh. That's not a good one. The young man said, I'm feeling good about himself. He told him, that's all I'm going to do. That's one and that's another. Right. He said, well, thou knowest the Ten Commandments, the commandments, this do and I shall live. Oh, yeah, all oh, these I kill for my youth. Amen. Jesus said to man, you look pretty good. Yes. But Jesus yes. looked at him and since he asked, he told him, but yeah, there's one thing you like. One. What is that? Show, I can do that. Sign. Get rid of your money. It's easy to trust God more you can buy your way. You can pay, but count me do like Solomon said. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Depend on him to make the way for you without your riches. Tell it! That was his downfall. Because he couldn't serve God without money. He hung his head and went away. And Jesus said, Lord, I'm catching the parable on the back. I'm sorry. Come on. All right, man. Since it's going to do you like that, come on. We'll keep your money. You can follow me. <laughs> you hear my okay, so people. Tell, tell him I'm sorry. I was just playing with it. <laughs> uh-huh. Man is not killed by bread alone, but by every word that can speak it out of the mouth of God. Even if we are to be the servants of Christ, we must obey, amen, what God said. At one point, amen, the people came looking for Jesus, and they found him, and they told him, Jesus, your mother and your sister, your, your family are looking for you. Jesus said, who is my mother, my sister, my brother? And then he pointed his hand to the side and said, these are him that do it, the will of my father, the same of my mother, my sister, my you show obedience to the word of God that makes you just serve the father. Now, it's getting kind of long, so let me go on and take you home here. Right. What is it? Now, Paul told you, right man, hey man, he said, nevertheless, the foundation of God standing sure. What is a foundation? Right. Foundation is the very thing in which the building is found and established upon. The building is only as good as the foundation, do right. Amen. 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 Praise God. Oh, but if you look at this situation here, amen, we find out that it's not a fulfilled foundation. All right. Since the devil couldn't destroy the church, yes. Jesus said the gates of hell would not prevail again. Yes. Since he couldn't start it, All right. Brother Blanks, you know what he did? Yeah. He did the next, next best thing. He started a bunch of long church to scatter my place. Yes. He had God's yeah. church in plain sight. So now, God's just standing in the way you can see. That's God's old path. Play in the good way. And when you find it, walk in the good way. Keep going. And you find Jesus said in John 5, 39, I told you, search the scriptures. For if you think you have eternal life, somebody going to hell think they're doing God's service. Do you know what I'm saying? All right. So since there are other foundations out there, how? And the disciples asked Jesus in, in the book of our John, how can we know the way, Lord? Amen. How can he say, I am the way, the truth, and the life? How can we know the way, Lord? Mm. Well, he told you in Isaiah 35 and 8, the highway shall be there. Yeah. Amen. And they way. And it shall be called the way of hope. Oh, yes. Amen. 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 What is it now? We go back, if we go to the second chapter, back, right, take it to home where the church began. Most people you talk to know that Jesus established the church, was founded it on the day of Pentecost, and we got to go back to find out what they taught on the day of Pentecost to make sure we are a servant of Christ. Somebody said, well, why are you always talking about the apostles? Peter was big mouth. Peter denied the Lord. Peter was the one talking about that stuff behind. Well, this, I believe in 2 Corinthians 4, 3 and 4, the apostle Paul said, if our gospel is here, it is here too, then that alone. The poor birth in whom the small G-O-D, God of this world, has blinded the mind of them which believe not, lest the light of the glory of the gospel of Christ should shine unto them. Now, I'm not saying they got permission, but then he turned around and said, it's the gospel of Christ. The apostle's gospel was the gospel given them by Christ. If we neglect so great salvation, which at the first began to be spoken by the Lord. Since we didn't hear the Lord, it was confirmed unto us by them that heard him, which were in the park. Amen. The Lord, our apostle Amen. Amen. In Ephesians 2, 19 and 20, the apostle Paul said, You are no more for on the 
strangers, but fellow citizens with the saints and of the household of God, and are built upon the foundation, which means the doctrine or the teaching of the apostle and prophet. Jesus Christ himself being the chief of the That's why he said one more vision. One, one faith. One. Everybody's going to be saved got to have the same faith, the same God. Well, I don't see it like that. I don't believe it like that. I might miss I'm going to ask you to let the word go. We're going to like to find what a servant of Christ is going to do. Now, mind you, in 1 John 5 and 3, John said, Hereby know we the love of God, that we keep his commandments, and his commandments are not grievous. It don't make you mad. God says to do what God said do. A servant is going to do what his master said. Do you hear what I'm saying? Acts 2, 1 through 4, what did he say? It was a day of Pentecost. When the day of Pentecost was fully come, they were all with one accord. Everybody that was with one accord, that means they were all on the green. Yeah. Everybody had the same doctrine, the same teaching, read. In one place. Uh huh. And suddenly there came a sound from heaven as of a rushing mighty wind. See, it takes a long time for to get people's minds to come together. Amen. Right. So I'm out to say they've been up there about a week. I don't know how long they had to search it out, but it took them a long time for all their minds to come together. And when they got together, Bishop, so that's why God came in a hurry. Because you can't get folks to stay together long. So we came in like a rushing mighty wind. Read on. And it filled all the house where they were. Now notice what happened on the day of Pentecost. That rushing mighty wind came in and filled all the house where they were sitting. Read on. And they appeared unto them. And they appeared unto some. Them. They appeared unto them what? Clothed in tongues like as a fire. Yes, God. They appeared unto them clothing tongues like of the fire and it set up on each of them. Mm -hmm. And they were all filled with the Holy Ghost and began to speak with other tongues. Now notice this, Bishop. They were all filled with the Holy Ghost and began to speak with tongues that the Spirit gave them utter. Uh -huh. How does it mind that the folks saying they got the Holy Ghost and they spoke in tongues? Well, right. Hebrews 13 and they said, Jesus Christ the same yesterday, today, and forever. If God didn't change, we didn't change. change. Uh -huh. You see that? You can shout, you can dance, and now they fish and they made up tongues. Amen. 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 Confess with your mind. Well, I'm 
established this by that a witness in Matthew 20 and 19. That's right. Amen.
Babylon. Our souls entrusted yes. with the leaders of the churches. Right. Amen. Yes. Yes. Amen. Amen. We're going to do something. We need to pray. Amen. Pray for our leaders. Amen. Amen. Pray for those that are in charge. You know, if the Lord says pray for the rulers and the government, he sure won't want you to pray for those in charge of your soul. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 He said the ministers of God, amen, bear not the sword in vain. Amen. You might be cut sometimes. If you walk in prayer, you might be cut sometimes. God bless you tonight. Amen. Is there anyone here who wants to warns, praise the Lord, that desire a closer walk with God? Or perhaps you're afflicted in your body. Perhaps you're facing sickness, you're facing disease. But you don't want to face it alone. You want the face of God, amen, to journey together in prayer. Amen. For you, we want to ask you at this time, if you just raise your hand. Praise him. Amen. There is one tonight. Just raise your hand. Praise him. Praise the Lord. Praise him. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Come on, just stop now. Pray time.
just for the property you say you leave off your stuff, you look like diamonds in your face. Hallelujah. God bless you. Love you, Jesus. What's our doctrine? Amen. 